running room um, because I used to work here. I used to actually be the manager of this store, and so we wrote a scene in the script to take place at a running store, kind of tying into my own experiences as a manager. The idea for 13 Miles came from my own experience in the triathlon world. I used to run or compete in Ironman triathlons and marathons. Elena and I decided to write a story after we volunteered at a triathlon race a few years ago. We decided to write a story about two triathletes who kind of used triathlon to get figure out some things in their life. Through some of the triathlons that, that we kind of worked with, we were able to get some sponsors, different brands and so on on board who kind of want to, it's, it seems like a perfect fit for them to get their stuff in the movie and also they've been helping out to fund the film. Running Room has been great, they've been giving us the opportunity to film here which is fantastic. It's it's a massive amount of production value for for them to offer us and it may, it'll make the movie look pretty good. So some of the brands we're going to be seeing in the film, uh, you'll see A6 Shoes, Pub Wetsuits, Core Sports, which is a clothing company for uh, women's uh, athletic gear. They're going to be prominently displayed in the movie. Cora is played by uh, Giovanna, and Darcy is played by Jeff, and Becca is played by Naomi. Laura Lee Burke. I'm a costume designer. And how long have you been doing costume designing for? Um, half my life. Um, I know uh, Anthony I met on one of Chad Costin's films. He was helping out with him on a feature and that's how we originally met and we've actually worked on TV shows together. We worked on Motive together. I was assistant costume designer. That's actually when he first approached me about working on the show. Makeup. Kind of am a jack of all trades. Um, I do beauty, I do glamour, special effects, blood, gore, prosthetics, all of that fun stuff. Today we're gonna have some blisters on Cora's feet, so that should definitely be fun. I did some tests last night using some silicone where you mix the two parts together and then it slowly begins to solidify, so hopefully it should be good. <laughs> uh, I do location sound for a film. I went to Vancouver Film School a couple years ago for sound design and post production, uh, nice. but I got more work doing. The last couple of years, probably 20 plus. Uh, Michelle Muldoon, I'm working crafty today. How did you meet Anthony and Helena? Uh, on an indie film set, yeah. I was doing background on an indie film that they were working on. And you worked on a lot of sets before? Uh, a number of them, yeah. I also shoot my own stuff. Uh, mostly shorts. Um, kind of action-y stuff. Hey, I'm Giovanna. I'm playing Cora. Cora is, um, she's basically just gone through a really big heartbreak and she's trying to find herself. So she's kind of like looking high and low to figure out who she is and where she belongs because she's been in this like kind of relationship for the last 10 years of her life and that's been everything. And now she's like, her, her whole world has just kind of exploded. So she's kind of finding herself through running and through triathlon and she's trying to say yes to everything right now and figure mm -hmm. out who she is. Today we are um, we're shooting a scene where we've just gone on a long run. I'm, I've joined a running club. Um, I've met this new guy, and um, they kind of coax me into going to Oliver to a, a half Ironman. I was not a runner. No, I started running when I started doing this film. Darcy's kind of your guy next door. He's um, super approachable. He's He's in it for love and long-term relationships. My name's Naomi Levi. I am playing Becca, the sassy uh, friend that she befriends in Running Club. She's the friend that kind of makes it more bearable. She's got a lot of fun, she sees the best in life, and she likes to, anything she does, she does with gusto and finds the humor in it. Have you ever done any running previous to this? No. Do you like to, no? <laughs> The most important question, what kind of waffles does that come with? Uh, all the fruits. All the fruits? Anything that you don't want on it? No, go wild. Go wild. Becca. That's the most important question for Becca. Go wild. Whatever you think Becca would eat, I will eat. Except for bacon. Becca doesn't eat bacon. So today, we have just finished a jog, and obviously we are glowing with delightfulness. <laughs> and uh, I'm trying to persuade her along with Darcy to come to an event next weekend where Darcy will be racing and I will be drinking. We're gonna do 
one more for safety. Do we have any? I think it'll be fine. All right, let's do one more. Your name is Alex. Yes, I am a staff. Of the actual running room. Uh, yes. <laughs> Thank you for letting us use your store. No <laughs> Action rehearsal. Action. This is good. And I think it's really good. Commentary. Yeah. This one is, it's really thick, kind of hard to peel open and get in there. It's, it's lifting a little bit, so probably gonna have to restick the flesh. I think we really have something here, you know? <laughs> and set. Action! Look to this space this way as we hinge. Look at her feet. Look up. Nope, she's looking. Go back down. <laughs> down speed. 48 Echo 3, tail slide. And set. Action. Ready. Rehearsals up, quiet please lock up and first positions on rehearsal. Cut. And we're cut. <laughs> and set. Action. Cut. <laughs> the wrap. There you go. Woo! I was like, you haven't said it yet. You can't just say that. Thank you, thank you. 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 Thank you.